offensively, I, I, I'm, I've got to roll with Will Howard for a big game because I'm, again, that's that's my prediction for the year. I'll say it again and again. He's going to break the very minuscule single season touchdowns his record for K State. It was funny last week as I was watching USC flirt around with danger with San Jose State for a half, and they show Caleb Williams numbers and how many touchdowns he threw last season. And you think that that is double the best in K-State football history, basically, with what he's done. So uh, I'm interested in Will Howard. You have to remember, I mean, the single season record is only 20-something. Like, like, this is not a shot at Kansas State, but that is a very underwhelming single season touchdown record. (laughs) Yeah, I mean, that's that's kind of the point. It's like... A couple of years ago when the like Mike Moustakis broke the Royals single season home run records and all he had to do was hit like 36 of them. Uh, it's since been up by that. Jorge Soler and Salvador Perez have hit 48 now. So the Royals were like one of the last teams to never have somebody hit 40 home runs. And this season they finally had that happen a couple of times. Um, I don't know. I mean, I think you're right. Like I want, I want that because I, you know, I want my prediction to be right, but it's probably under just because, there are so many unknowns because essentially that means Will Howard basically in the first half has to come out there and throw four touchdown passes because he's probably only going to play up to the fourth quarter and there will be a lot of running using DJ Gins and Trayshawn Ward. And like you said, Avery Johnson and Jake Rivley will get in there. 